to become an elite penalty killer in the league, um, you know, it takes takes a lot of different elements that you know aren't always taught uh, growing up. Uh, a lot of times, you get players that in the NHL that are high-end scorers that become third, fourth-line guy, guys that maybe haven't always been taught some of those elements uh, that top NHL penalty killers have. So we're we're kind of experimenting with some guys a little bit. I thought Bailey did a good job. He, he uh, Again, he's been in the league, or he's been a pro now for a few years and understands, probably seen a lot of different uh, attributes that go into penalty killing. You know, I think our guys are, are doing their best, at, and it's still a work in progress, though. A lot of it's reading in hockey sense and understanding what the, the, pen, the power play is trying to do. It's also being brave, um, being in shot lanes, uh, understanding that when you're, when you're in that shot lane, you're going to have to block a shot if a pass is made, but also understanding that... Um, little nuances that the other team is trying to do even to get you to move a stick into a lane so it opens something else up and I think the top penalty killers uh, they can almost be you know they can almost run their own penalty kill meeting sometimes where they they understand it uh, they understand little changes that are happening during the game uh, what hand a guy is if they make a, a quick switch and uh you know, those are just some of the little details that take some time to really learn and understand and look for uh, that maybe a young player doesn't pick up. Or on the power play, they've, you know, they've done that their whole life and they've been taught certain well? things. I did, uh, but not, not till a little later in my career. Uh, I think it's something that um, you know I'm trying to add uh, to my game. It's something that um, I think with with my speed and uh, you know my ability to close out on guys and have a long reach. It's something that. Um, you know, I'm, I'm working on a lot with, with the coaching staff here, and that was something that was communicated to me. Um, you know, when I got sent down, was uh, you know they wanted me to work on that, and I got a ton of P PK time down in Abbotsford, and um, you know we, we you know, I was able to put together uh, you know a pretty good game uh, the first game doing that.